Hello everyone. Okay, you're welcome to Fuku Math channel. Today we have 5 to the power of x plus 5 to the power of x equals 50. Okay, so if you're new to this um, channel, you should do well to subscribe so you can get more of my videos. Now this is very simple. We have the same term on the left so we can add them. Or better still, factorize 5 to the power of x. Then here we're going to have 1 plus 1. And this will be equal to 50. If we take a step further, 5 to the power of x multiplied by 2 is equal to 5. Okay, that's 50. Now, since we are multiplying 5 to the power of x times 2, to remove the 2, you have to divide it by itself, and it will reflect on the other side. This and this can go. So now we have 5 to the power of x to be equal to, here we have 25. Now, you can now see that this is even way easier than some of you were thinking. Now our next target is to make sure that this right here have the same base. So when we have 5 to the power of x, on the other side we're going to have 5 times 5. This is my times. So now 5 to the power of x is equal to 5 to the power of 2. And what we have done is to equate the bases, right? What happens to the power? There should also be equal. So x is equal to 2. This is the solution to the problem. But like you know, we always verify to make sure that we are correct. The equation given is 5 to the power of x plus 5 to the power of x equals 50. Now if that is the case, x will now be 2 then plus 5 to the power of 2. The question is, do you think this equals 50? 5 squared is 25. 5 squared again, 25. And 25 plus 25 is giving us 50. Right? So this means that we are very correct to say that the value of x in 5 to the power of x plus 5 to the power of x equals 50 is equal to 2 so this is the value of x thank you for watching and if you have not subscribed to my channel subscribe so you can get more of my videos